It's moving weekend. Let's go, let's go. We're moving. We're moving. <laughs> Give me a whole yeah. Great, Mom, look how, look at this, look at this. <laughs> This is the current moving situation. This is not good. Because the the thought process behind this is why should I have to put it away when I'm literally just gonna put it in a box in like now? So we've just so she's let it mount it up. Sorry, you coming to make pancakes? Yes. By the way, it's currently what time is it? Morning everyone. Or like mid afternoon everyone. Hello. How are we all? I've got a new tripod and it's kinda shit. Anyway, welcome back to the vlog. We are officially moving tomorrow into our new third year flat, which we are so excited for. Basically, over summer, we really wanted to move and just like have a different flat for third year because we thought like, why not? Like, fuck it. Like, we might as well try living out somewhere different. Um, but there was no flat available in September. They literally were getting snatched up so fast. It was crazy. So we found one. Um, and then we're like, oh, it's not gonna be ready till like end of November. And we were like, okay, like that's fine. Um, so we waited it out, but the day has come. It's really weird. Like we secured this flat like end of September, and we were like, oh, it's only two months. Like that will fly by, and now the day's finally here. Like it's crazy. So today's Sunday. We're moving in on Monday. So today we've got to pack up get boxes sorted, make sure we've cleaned the place. And then tomorrow we've got a man with a van coming to transport all our stuff. And also my mum's coming up to help us move everything across. Um, and also mum's never seen this flat. And obviously she hasn't seen the new flat. So this is her first time like coming up and actually seeing where I live because she's a snake and she hasn't been up. I think it's because I go down quite a lot, but it's fine. But anyway, we're gonna make some pancakes this morning because I haven't vlogged this week because I've literally just felt so ill. Like it's just hit me. I think it was Friday night. I think it was Friday night and I literally just could not move off the sofa. I had a blocked nose. My throat hurt so much. I've still got a bit of a blocked nose, but it's fine. I'm powering through, but I want to make some breakfast before we start packing. And we're going for a roast today, aren't we? Woohoo! We're going to our favourite place, the wharf. So yeah, we've got a fun, busy, proactive day ahead of us of packing, of moving. Okay, I've made the batter. I've just literally put flour, a bit of sugar, two eggs and some milk. Literally so easy. And a little bit of baking powder, just so they grow a little bit. Um, but we don't have any vanilla extracts, so I'm gonna put some vanilla protein powder in them. This is the best protein powder ever, if you're looking for one. It's Hermosa, I got chocolate and vanilla, they literally came yesterday, but they're delicious. When me and Maddie used to walk to Barry's and get a protein shake, this is the protein shake that Barry's uses, and it's literally delicious. So, I haven't actually tried the vanilla one, um, like myself but i know maddie's had it in matcha protein shakes at barry's and it's tasted delicious so i'm gonna put a scoop in there we go i might just put like maybe not all of that i might just put like half of that in mm, but it smells so vanilla -y. give that a mix oh my god it smells so vanilla -y. yeah it smells so nice literally smells like you know like birthday cake like that smells so good Okay, give that a mix, and then we're ready. Do you want chocolate chips in here? Yeah. Yeah. What roast dinner are you going to have today? Wait, maybe then. Ooh, you always did look good. Can we go later on then, because we've had, like, lunch now? Yeah, 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 I'll push it back. This is like, to be fair, whoa, that's actually quite a lot. That'll be all right, I think. We haven't got any Nutella rip, but we've got maple syrup and like butter. So we're gonna do that. Ugh. But to be fair, with chocolate chip American ones, butter and maple syrup is nicer. Perfect. Okay, they're cooking away nicely. I'm gonna flip this. Ooh. They look good. They're nice and thick. Because I put like self rising flour and baking powder in. God, Sunday mornings are for pancakes, guys. 
I didn't see eyeballed the rest of the bag. Ooh, nice. This one's a big, a big one. I don't know if I'm going to flip her on camera. Okay, we're, we're done. We've got my little pancakes with my banana. Then we've got some golden syrup and some butter. Maddie's. <laughs> I've had to cut it in half because they're so thick. They take, like, they take. Hopefully these are cooked. I literally don't know in the middle. Hopefully they will be. They feel spongy. We went to go see Black Panther 2 um, this week and it was literally insane, wasn't it? It was amazing. It was insane. And Mads has never seen number one, so we've just put it on now. Black Panther's my favourite like Marvel film, I think. It's incredible. It's my favourite franchise. So yummy. Okay, it's begun. It's begun. These are the only boxes we have, and I'm kind of regretting not buying more. I literally thought this would be enough, but they're kind of thin. I thought they'd be big square ones, and they're like thin ones, but I'm sure it'll be fine. So I'm taking these two um, into my room. Here she is, all ready to go. So what I'm going to do is, things I want go in the box. Things that are going to go on Depop just go on the bed, and I'm going to take pictures of them and sell them all because everything I don't wear anymore I want to give a new life and I'm gonna sell on Depop because I'm just gonna have a big clear out I feel like it's needed in my life I don't know what this pile is we'll get rid of that pile right we're ready Right, these are my drawers. Under here, I put all my bedding, and this is all my laundry. Basically, I've just let pa things pile up, so I, like, do excuse the mess. Okay, in here, this is just, like, my tops. Like, this is, like, my cuckoo bodysuit, another bodysuit, that, which I'll probably sell, and another bodysuit. Just things like this. What? Oh, I love this top. <laughs> this is relieving the moving stress. Last Christmas. My favorite is Ariana Grande's. Oh my god, I went on this day. I went to this in the library. Did you? She's Gemini in the library, guys. Packing has commenced. 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 This is tops and bodysuits. Down here I've got trousers. This is going to be my hats, bags, jewellery box. So I actually need to write on there with the pen. Hats. Hats. Bags. And maybe jewellery. How do you spell jewellery? How do you spell jewellery? Jewellery. It's a double L. I'm going to go for double L. There we go. Put some hearts on there. Really cute. There we go. I'm just going to put all my bags in this box. There we go. My little Prada one. Got my orange one, my Dior, my Jacquemus, my little cream one all going in there more hats but yeah i might have to put some of these hats on depop i've got too many more hats and then my little balenciaga bag i should probably put the, put this in her dust bag um so she doesn't get squished but put them in there oh it's a bit small where's her dust bag okay this is a good system tops in there and then down here this is my depop um bag with all my depop in it oh shit i've got these as well oh you're coming with me in you go this um is very special to me because this is a present that chin got me last year and she got it in new york at the coach store and it's so cute i love it and then i've got my little blue one that i got in italy so cute but yeah this is my bag there we go. Nice. Perfect. And then I'm sure we'll be transporting this ladder across because she's just so cute and she's just such a nice little addition to my room. I've got... What's this? Oh, look. This is a little memory. I like to keep all my memories. This is the ticket from New York. Um, and this is a cliff bar that mum got me and I haven't even eaten yet. Room key. 
Don't know what that's from, it's probably from New York. And then another little dust bag that I'll put in there. Okay, next box, all important one I'm gonna do is like joggers and tracksuits. I've already started a bit, so I'm just gonna write it. What should I put? Tracksuits or like comfies? I don't really know. Do I just put tracksuits? Put some hearts. Oh, drawers are empty. They're all empty. This is what I'm currently dealing with that I've kind of pulled out of the wardrobe. Up here, I know this is absolutely gross, but this is all my hoodies and stuff where I've kept them. Um, and then this is all like my nicely hung up stuff. So this is what I'm gonna tackle next. And I've got my Pangea tracksuit here. And you know what? I'm just thinking like, I just, I never reach for this tracksuit anymore, even though I've loved it. Oh God, what's that stain on there? Oh god, that's hair dye there. Oh my god. Right, this is the current situation. Um, I'll give you a tour. There's method to the madness. So, boxers, jackets, tracksuits. My nails are atrocious, by the way. Just don't look at them. Uh, trousers, bags, hats and shoes. This is tops. This is wardrobe stuff. Um, this is tra more trousers and this is all Depop stuff and then this is a pile that mum can take home with her because I don't need them. So that's empty, this is empty. This weighs an absolute ton by the way, it's literally just decorative stuff on my dresser. This is just a bin, need to take that. Um, so yeah, it's looking good. That little thing over there, that's empty, I just need to do this one. It's just full of like photos and stuff. Um, God, yeah, we're getting there, ladies. We're getting there. Mads has made a really good dent in hers. Literally, the flat is such a mess right now. Let's find some leggings to wear because we're gonna go on a roast now. We've done a lot, like, it is like half three. We've been doing this since 12, and all our bedrooms are pretty much done. We just need to do our bathroom and kitchen. Um, but this is my trousers. Let me see if I can find my grey. My grey leggings to wear. Oh my god, I found these. I found so many good things in my wardrobe. I found these like really cool flared grey leggings. Maybe I'll wear them. I literally found so much of the bottom of my wardrobe, you've got no idea. What's right there? No, don't do that, you'll ruin your own. No, I'm trying to get that lid. Right. No, just tip it, come on, tip the bin this way. Uh, just tip it this way. Yeah, like there. There we go. Just tip it like that, there oh. we go. Got it, got it. Get it, we get it. We got it. Ah! <laughs> Ew, we need to- <laughs> through all this. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're back at our favourite place ever. I got chicken again. And then she also got chicken again. Yeah, I got chicken. Got a little diet coat. Um, and we're sat up at the top today. It's actually really nice. Got a little view going on. There's three floors to this. Is it your floor upstairs as well? What? <laughs> well, we're just, we're trying to calm down after the the amount of packing. I feel like we're covered in dust and it's not nice. We're trying to prolong our dinner for as long as we can so we don't have to go back and pack. I know. We've got tea, we've got this little brownie and then we've got... What tea did you get? Nice. But we're just... We're just kind of going to chill out before we have to go back. And peck. Alright, we're back. And the kitchen is commencing. We're doing very well for ourselves. It's currently... Okay, it's only 8. Let's do like another hour, I think. And then tomorrow, that's next, that's tomorrow's problem. I'm cleaning out all the food cupboards to transition tomorrow. So I've got all the spice cupboards, like the soya sauce I'm putting in here. Very organized, very organized. Very organized. Look here. You want to make a hot chocolate tonight, don't you? Yeah. We've got two hot chocolates, you know. No. But look, this is the current state of the kitchen got all protein powders salt condiments coffee which we literally don't drink 
Um, it's more salt. What's this? Oregano, which I literally have not. Uh, rosemary, I literally have not opened that. Uh, salt and just stuff like that. And then we've got all that food up here. Oh, there's in the bowl. Oh, there you go. I don't know if there's any space. Is there any space? Well, do you want a quick chocolate? <laughs> and then we've got all this pasta here that I got from home last time I went. And we've got Gilmore Girls on. We're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, what a day. I've just literally sat down. What time is it? Half eight. We've been doing this since one, I think. But that is, I'm not going to lie, that is all my stuff. That is, all. <laughs> that is all my stuff. I don't know how one little girl has so much shit. That's also my suitcase down there. These are returns, to be fair. And then that's all the kitchen stuff and shoes down there. And now we're just chilling out. Got a little slippies on. Got some heroes over there. And we've got Gilmore Girls on. But yeah, this is the last night in the flat. This flat has served us very well. Hasn't it? It's sad. Very sad. On to bigger and better things though. <laughs> Aww. This is a gorgeous little first flight in Manchester. I'll never forget this flat. It's gorgeous. I loved it. It's beautiful. It is. Happy memories in here. Good morning, everyone. It's officially moving day. We are pretty much, I'm gonna say like 90% packed up. We've just gotta do a bit more like bedding and stuff. But anyway, we went this morning, we picked up our keys, we went to go and see the flat. Absolutely beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Had a little tour and now we're back. We're just waiting on mum to come and we're gonna start loading the car and then the van should come soon so let me give you a tour of the boxes so this is the kitchen stuff which i think we're going to load first just because it's closest to the door but like we've got like miscellaneous items that don't have a box but i'm sure we're fine and then we need to close that then you come around here this is like bedroom and bathroom stuff this is our depot bag um i've uploaded pretty much all of it so go and have a look at my Depops, Lily Bill is alone. Hats, whatever, dressing gowns, blah, blah, blah. And then the desk, that desk and the chair should go with the movers. And then we've got Maddie, who's literally still got some laundry out. Oh, no. You're going to have to pack that away, girly. This is Maddie's stuff down here. Suitcases. Anyway, and then this is the kitchen box. So should we do kitchen first, do you I think? think? So. Is that, does that make it I more sense? Bags, okay, bro. Well, I'll start packing the stuff because we're gonna put everything downstairs just out of the flat so it's easier to be moved for mum and stuff. But we're moving, we're saying goodbye to these keys. Oh my god, new keys. <laughs> Any vans text me, your driver is heading your way, bro. Wow. Shit, we kind of need to empty the flat before they come. Okay, wait. I'll be a okay, see you in a minute. I'll start loading stuff. Okay. And then where is mum? She's in hide. So she's about half an hour away. Perfect. Real. Let's get moving. Mum is here. Woo, we've got our mover, recruiter. Right, we've pretty much done half of it. This is our second trip now. This is my bathroom stuff and we're moving the kitchen stuff as well. This is like things for the fridge and the cupboard stuff. Are we ready? Look, I bought this like moving wheelie thing. So we're just going to wheel all this down. You ready? You're in charge of the wheelie thing, mum. Yep. Down it goes. And Maddie's already gone down because basically I take my personal, like my laptop and all that stuff. Um, in these bags, which are here. So I'm going to take have them with me. Have you got anything there that you want to take? Do you have, is there anything more there that you want to take over? Um, I don't think we can carry any more, Mum. Can you? Or maybe we can actually. Hold on. Yeah. I'll just push these boxes out. Okay, my camera is buried somewhere back there. Pack the car out. Pack the car Okay, we're in, we've made it, we're in the new flat. This baby has saved our lives today. We literally borrowed it, it was downstairs in the foyer and we've loaded up 
you know, all our belongings on this. And Mads has been running it back and forth around Manchester, but we've accidentally marked the wall. But that's all right. We've got all our stuff in. Fucking hell, now we've got to unpack. Oh no. But we've got Maddie unpacking here. We're gonna just quickly unpack the kitchen. It's looking good. So Quick good. transition over Woo! the fridge. I'm so excited. Um, we've, we're so hot, we've not eaten, my hair's greasy. I'm in this weird ass outfit. I was like, I really hope we don't run into our neighbors because I look atrocious. Here she is. Hello. She had the wee in the first, the first wee in the I apartment. Yeah. Ugh, that was Maddie's yeah. bathroom as well. Was it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I thought you went in the yeah. main one. Yeah. That was so yeah. funny. Yeah. But we've got the toaster and kettle, yeah. and they look really nice in the new flat. They've set it's a nice colour scheme. Look. Yeah, yeah. Very right nice. now we've got to unpack. But we did it, guys. Mm. We're still waiting. Yeah. We're waiting for the van to come and get the sofa and all the rest of it. But our workers pretty much done now we're just gonna yeah. rely on the van oh they've just texted me the van people have just texted me hey lydia your driving is heading your way cool, cool. all right then Abby is wheeling back that cage thing because i think we're going to need it for the van and we're just going to drive now to the old flat but we're pretty much all moved in we just need like the big items now and I'm starving. We've literally had a matcha and a banana all day. We're so hungry. Join the club. No. Do you like the new flat then? Yeah, it's lovely. Because yeah. mum, fun fact guys, mum's never come up to Manchester to see my flat. Well, not this, the other flat. Not the other flat. Like. So now she's come up and she christened it, didn't you? Yeah. With your wee. <laughs> Thanks for that. We um, haven't eaten all day, so it's six o'clock and, and we've just had mcdonald's but we're in <laughs> everything is in and we feel quite claustrophobic <laughs> we feel very claustrophobic all right we're gonna eat and we'll feel better but we're Ooh. in and we don't know where the fucking remote is no that's in my um is it my laundry basket which is wet okay Sorry. I literally just woke up. It's the next day. We had a McDonald's and I literally, I literally had to sit down for literally like three hours because I was exhausted. I got up, I made my bed. Manny had to go to work, bless her. I felt so bad. So I made her bed as well and I unpacked a bit of the kitchen. I was just pottering around and like doing bits and just like moving boxes. So I'm gonna get ready for the day. And um, I'll show you what I did. But yeah, I did quite a bit. But we've still got like clothes to do. And then as I was unpacking all the fucking kitchen stuff, I realised we not unpacked the dishwasher. And I'm, we're missing like our frying pan, our saucepan. And I'm like, shit. So we have to go back to the old flat. Thank God I've still got the keys. I've still, we've got to go back today and pick up the drawers for the desk. And then obviously unload the dishwasher because we're idiots. But yeah, I'm gonna get ready for the day, but I already love it here. Oh, just had a shower. We've got no hot water. Sorry, my throat is still, I still feel like I'm getting ill. Can you hear me? Not good. But basically, how weird is this? So we've got hot water in all the taps, but we don't have hot water in our showers. And I'm really confused by that. And I've just like gone to the boiler and it says the water was off so I've turned that on. But I think it needs a little bit more time to like kick in. Because I tried to then have a shower and it didn't work. But I had like a quick like body rinse. I'm going to do my makeup. It's like 11am and I think Maddie's still asleep. But we're going to have to go to the flat quickly um, before she's got uni. And yeah, I'm just going to get ready now. Basically at our, at our old flat we had some chest of drawers. Um, but we don't have any here so I kind of want to get like a little vanity just like a small like one seater one just to like do my makeup and like put my perfumes on um I might have a look on like Facebook marketplace or I don't know eBay maybe I'll have a little look to see if there's like a, a good second hand one I can buy because I think it would look really cute you know just like there I think it would really add something to the room and I need to put my mirror in here. Honestly, like waking up here and like having a shower and like doing my skincare here, it just feels way more, 
I already feel way more homelier than I than I did at the other place. I don't know I don't know why that is, but I just feel way more just like this is my space. Like I didn't really feel like the last apartment was like, yeah, this is my space. I was kinda Do you know what I mean? But this one feels more at home i feel so happy here already and i can't wait to just like start unpacking and just like moving all the boxes and just like cleaning and just actually living in this flat i'm really excited but we have an exciting update i don't know if i've said this before but i'm gonna i'm getting a new car getting a new car which i'm so excited for um i found one she well the car is in perth in scotland so she's got a scottish accent that's not a Scottish accent, but you know what I mean. And that's actually really funny because Olivia's car was from Scotland as well. So maybe they're like cousins. Maybe they're like Scottish cousins. But it just makes me laugh that she's going to have a Scottish accent. I don't know. It's just funny. Um, so I found one. She's in Scotland. And they're going to have to ship it to obviously Nottingham. Because I'll just pick it up from Nottingham whatever. So that's in the process. And I'll hopefully get that in the next coming weeks. I need to ring them today actually. And I have reserved one, which I'm so... <laughs> like, she is, like, the car is mine, basically. Because I've reserved it. Um, and I'm so excited. I can't wait to show you. I can't wait to do drive with me's. And it's just going to be so nice having a car here. I actually need to start doing my makeup. You know what I want to get today in town? I'm going to go makeup shopping. Because I really want a foundation brush. I used to have a rare beauty one. And now I can't find it. So I've really got this. And I can't be able to get on my tip. So, yeah. I just can't wait to have a car in Manchester. Like, when I drove around the Fiat that got loaned to me it was just so fun like we had so much freedom like we could go and do so much more so i'm just excited to get it i'm really excited and i can't wait to show you and do drive with me because you guys will be the first to see she's real cute now we're just gonna we've got some errands to do we're gonna go post office gonna go to the old flat maddie's got uni but this is my outfit of the day got these cute jeans on got my uggs on and then this is the best crop top from i i don't know a y m i think i think and then i really want to go get my nails done today because these are atrocious they're making me feel sick every time i look at them but anyway we're gonna go to starbs first we're gonna just get a little matcha and maybe what's up <gasps> we're easily impressed look at money's look at money's light I wonder wow. if I've got one. <gasps> wow. Oh, this wow. Is so nice. This is so nice. Just waiting for us to get ready. Sorry. All right. But I've just packed up all my Depop. I'm selling my stuff like hotcakes, which is great. But this is the bag of Depop. If you don't follow me on Depop, it's my name. It's Lady Bailey's Hello. I ship things pretty much the same day you buy them because... We've been clearing out this flat. But we've still got a lot of unpacking to do. Uh, and Maddie's at uni again today, so I'm just going to have to try and tackle it a little bit by myself. Um, this is mainly clothes, though, and then we just need to get the kitchen stuff sorted and then just, like, rearrange this area. And I need to do my clothes. But I think it's just going to be, like, a day-by-day -day thing. But I'm really excited and we're really happy to be here. I'm gonna do a full like apartment tour in the second moving vlog when everything is in and nice and properly and clean because this right now is not sliving. We're in that sliving life. We just come to Starbucks for some breakfast. I've really wanted to try these egg whites forever. They're like cheese and a ham. One for me, one for you. Wow, really cute. So cute. And then we got a matcha, and then I just got a sausage sandwich. <laughs> hey, Maddie. Right. Let's try this. They look like a little omelette. Look at that hot. Look at that very, look at all that steam coming out. All that steam. See, I like omelettes, I like eggs, so these should be nice. Mmm. Is it good? Yeah, really good. Oh my god, man. Man, it just tastes like a cheesy omelette. Oh my god, wow. They're amazing. Oh yeah, I'm a goiling. These 
Amazing, straight to that time. Amanda's gone to uni and I've just come back to the old flat just to get the last bits because we literally left a loaded dishwasher because we're idiots. So I've just unpacked the dishwasher. I've just done a quick hoover. Um, oh my God, it feels so empty. Hello. It's like echoing, but look, it's all empty. Oh, there's my room. Bye room. You were really good to me. And I'll miss you. Oh, it feels really sad and empty. Look, the sofa's gone. There's nothing in the cupboards. Honestly, it feels so like weird in here. But like, I've got, um, I just did a quick food shop, but I've got everything in there. And then I've got the drawers and the hoover, which we also forgot. And yeah, say goodbye to the flat for the one last time. Bye flat. We're back. That was probably the most stressful thing I've ever had to do. So stressful on my own as well. Oh my God. But anyway, I wanted to show you what I bought for the new kitchen. I don't think it's very exciting purchases. I think it's literally tea towels and stuff like that. But I'll show you what we bought. Maddie should be back from uni any minute. Okay, so our saucepan broke. So we got a new saucepan. This is from Asda. Oh my God, it's real cute. Let me unpack it for you. Oh my God, it's so cute. Look, it's like slate gray. It's got like eggshell. This is the new saucepan. How cute is this? That's so sweet. Gray. Where do you want to put all the saucepan stuff, by the way? Do you want to? I'm thinking down here. Yeah. Did you get a whisk? You're so funny. Did you yeah, I, I bought that just for my bake. And then I've done this straw. Oh my god. Wait, I need to show them. You've been so busy. I need to show them the whisk. Why do you want to show them the whisk? I bought a whisk. Just for my baking endeavours. When I get a bit bored. And this was literally like eight pounds. Oh, maybe ten pounds from Asda. So I'm going to unpack that and put that somewhere. Then we did a Wilco's order. Fucking love Wilco's. My I don't love, remember what we got. My love for Wilco comes from my dad. Okay, oh. first thing we got is a colander because we have not had a colander for literally how long? I think the whole time. It broke, didn't it? It broke. Oh, right, we'll put that down there. Real nice. Oh, and then we bought these tea towels. We also picked up just an oven tray because the only oven trays we have are really thick ones. And this was literally like two pounds. Just for like anything that we need to bake. Just in the oven. I bought these. <laughs> this is for my baking endeavors. They're just like mini kitchen scales. Really cute. They're a bit very small. That's okay. But they were like three quid. So I thought I'd rather spend I love three that. pounds and actually buy big ones. Because I don't know how much I'll use this, but I'll put them in here. Little home I haul for you all. We're ladies of leisure tonight. This is our first proper night here because you went to work yesterday, you rushed off. So we're having a past night. I've just found, I've literally found these in one of the kitchen drawers and I've put on some eye masks and took my makeup off. But we're just having a little bit of a past night because that was our favorite thing to make. We've got our new saucepan with the pasta, air fry, we've got garlic bread and meatballs. And then today we're using this sauce. The Barilla sauce is insane. And I've never had the ricotta flavor. So I'm excited to try. And then this is the new corner I set up today. This bowl Chintia got me for my birthday. Um, it's a watermelon, it's gorgeous. And I've just put some grapes in there. And then we've got the olive oil because that doesn't fit in any of the cupboards. Um, and yeah, still looking like a mess. But it's fine, we've got all weekend. That's perfect as well. Nice. Oh. She's looking nice and saucy. Garlic bread, meatballs. Yum. It's served. Dinner is served. And then mm. we've also got some garlic bread. I added some mozzarella balls because we have no parmesan. So I need to order that. But oh my God, I'm so hungry.